Any robust ecosystem needs a contracting layer, so CLAWS can help the Tezos ecosystem have that legally enforceable, regulatorily compliant layer to the applications that ultimately run on the Tezos blockchain. My name is Human Shadab. I'm a co-founder and the CEO of Clause. Clause is a platform for digitizing contracts and connecting them to a wide variety of software systems from enterprise software to blockchain uh, platforms. And th that enables traditional static and dry legal contracts to essentially come alive and be connected to the real world. It's important for Tezos for that functionality to exist because what that allows is for Tezos to have a legal contracting or legally enforceable layer for the applications that are related to or directly apply legal contracts with or on the Tezos blockchain. One barrier to adoption of smart contracts that clause uh, reduces or eliminates entirely in, in many cases is to make sure that the legal intent and the language of the contracting parties really matches up with the underlying smart contract code that is executed or otherwise integrated with the, with the blockchain. Because without the legal contract and the smart contract essentially being on par with each other, you can have operations that are enabled with the blockchain but are not legally enforceable. From a technical point of view, uh, what we're building at Clause includes a, a language for making it easier to adopt the legal logic of, of contracts to uh, smart contracts. We want that language to be close and very close to the legal natural text that people write in contracts. You should be able to look at the program you wrote um, and the natural language text of the legal contract and see that uh, they actually say the same thing, really. Using clause for legal contract, you should be able to really quickly assemble a new contract and deploy it on Tezos. Um, you know, in a matter of a few minutes. So I think it's going to make the life cycle much faster. In the legal world, people tend to have templates, and so uh, you should be able to take templates, adjust it for your application, and then deploy it. I'm really excited to see uh, sort of our first contract running on Tezos. I think there will be a lot of interesting technical challenges, and I think it's going to be that part I'm very excited about, I admit. The grant from Tezos is going to allow the contracting technology from Clause to connect to the Tezos blockchain by allowing us to take the language for smart legal contracts that we're developing at Clause and to compile down to or otherwise integrate with the Tezos blockchain and its own smart contracting language. The practice of transactional law and contract management has yet to fully embrace and become a part of the broader technological revolution that's happening. And filling that gap is what Clause is all about. Finally taking something that's been very traditional, very paper-based and manual processes involving contracts and contract management, really bringing it into the 21st century for the first time and reducing all many of the costs and inefficiencies associated with contract management as well as enabling a wide variety of new workflows and processes and business models ultimately through the Clause platform.